I can't. I still can't believe that guy won't let me in. <laughs> won't let me in Peach's room. Hello, guys, and welcome back to Tavern Tales and this experience on Paper Mario 64. Or I think it's 60. Oh, I can spin. Oh, that's right. I can spin with with Z or ZL. ZL. Yeah. I forgot. What I forgot to mention. What I forgot to mention in the last episode was a uh, like um. Uh, I guess, I guess on the last episode, we started, you know, this game of Paper Mario, and, uh, and, uh, we've been talking to people, having, you know, very thin conversations and whatnot, and, and, uh, yeah, and let us, let us, uh, continue on. Let us continue on, and, and, like, and really, um, like, because this game is, like, not in, like, a 4 by 3 aspect ratio... Hold on. It's nice and quiet here with no guests around, so... Ah, so pleasant. I guess here in this room, yeah. But yeah, like, since this game is, doesn't actually take up the full 4 by 3 aspect ratio, I don't know if I want to... Just have, you know, you know all the cropping be at 4 by 3s because... Because I don't remember what scenes, like, I don't, like, I, I don't know what will, will go to the whole 4x3 ratio, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not gonna worry about it. If there are black bars, like, if there's other black bars, that's not my fault. It's the game. It's the game not using, you know, the four, the true 4x3 aspect ratio. And then again, it is on the Wii U, so it's I'm kind of forced into it. I'm not not doing any other emulators or anything. I don't know if people are interested. I am, I, I am, uh, I did put, uh, I and I will leave uh, my I guess controller layout uh, since I am playing on the on the uh, Pro controller on the Wii U Pro controller. So I will do that at least. Uh, just if people are interested in what my control and how I'm actually playing this game like what controller I'm using and what the layout is for because the virtual console on my Wii U Princess Pro Princess Peach went, <laughs> went into her private chambers just now. Wait, wasn't that downstairs? Wasn't that downstairs in the other room in the last episode? All right. Well, let's just go Let's just go in Oh Man, we're having thin conversation. A lot of thin conversations. All right, let's see. That's a big room. Oh my gosh, she's so pretty. Oh my god. Oh Mario, you came to, you came to the party. You, s you came to the party to see me. You're so sweet. Thank you. Heart emoji. I was just resting a bit. It's, it gets tiring, greeting all those guests out there. I would imagine. I don't know why you need a nap, just sit down for a bit, but yeah. Nobody will bother us here. We shall relax, relax and chat. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. <laughs> and he just nods, yes, yes. Good Good response, Mario. You, you're not allowed to talk. You're, con you're contractually ob... ob obligated to not talk like that is that is the point it was it was a lovely day today so i'm sure it's come it's comfortable on out on the balcony right now would you accompany me mario maybe oh shit oh my controller's vibrating as well oh no oh my gosh look at all those polygons that paper thin tree just disappeared just disappeared it fell over and just disappeared Look at all those polygons. Oh my gosh, look at those N64 graphics on that castle. Look at all those polygons. So we're running, running, ah! What do we do, what do we do? Oh, we're in space. How did Bowser get to this? How, I guess the star rod. I guess the star rod would do it, but yeah. Oh. Are you all right, Mario? What in the world was that? Was that what? What that small earthquake or us just running around, running around in circles in a, in sheer panic, just doing stuff and whatnot? Oh my! Look, Mario. 
It's still daytime, isn't it? But I can see the stars outside! Yes, we're... Oh my gosh, how are we still breathing? Ah, ha, 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 ha. Long time no see, Princess Peach. Bowser? But this can't be. It was you who made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? You're the reason why we were running around in circles in a panic doing nothing about it. Why didn't we leave? Why didn't we leave the castle while we had the chance? We could have just busted out the window. And I could have glided, and I could have glided down. You know, I have a self parachute, you know. Whatever did you do? Ah, ha, 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 ha. Yes, that was me. I've lifted your castle up into the sky. It's now, it's sitting on my castle now. Weren't expecting that, huh? Ha! <laughs> this castle's under my control now, my dear. Now you will obey me, type thing, I don't know. Huh? What? It's Mario! What a shock! Oh my god! I'm so terrified right now. I'm getting Vietnam flashbacks of all those... Of just jumping into lava all the time. <laughs> Not really. I expected you to turn up right on cue. You're just as annoying as ever. Unfortunately for you... There's nothing you can do this time. Well, why not, man? I want to do something. I can do something. I can stomp your ass a couple times. That's what I can do. Haven't you learned your lesson by now, Bowser? You can never defeat Mario. Why don't you just give up already? L hey, hey. I... I... And maybe he grew spikes on- I mean, maybe those spikes on his head are actually gonna be useful for him. True, true. I've had my problems in the past. But this time is different. What problems are you referring to, sir? Because I can start making a list, you know, of all, of all your problems, Bowser. This time, I'm gonna win. Okay, tough guy. Let's go. <laughs> Mario, why'd you trip? Why'd you trip up? This isn't this isn't Smash Bros. Brawl. Mario, you could do it. Just don't trip over yourself. All right. Okay. Can't select it now. Can't select. I can only I can only jump on this fool. Is there, is there an axe on the other side of him somewhere? Is there a hidden axe? Ow. I spun around like a top there. Look at that. Alright. Lovely turn-based combat. <laughs> I like that an animation. Peach is like, oh my god! My, oh my god, I'm such a damsel in distress. Whatever am I gonna do? Mario, stomp on his ass! He's just flailing around. What is he doing? Good old Mario, always fighting. You're a thorn in my side. But today, your pathetic little attacks won't beat me. It's working well so far, man. I don't know what else to say. Like, really. Oh my gosh, he has, he has a stick with a star on it. Take a look at this. Look what I stole from Star Haven. It's the Star Rod. What's Star Haven? What's the Star Rod? Like, what is that? What is that? Like, Mario and Mario and Peach. I mean, uh, probably Peach would know, but Mario would have absolutely no clue what he's talking about. This fine piece of work has the power to grant any wish in the whole in the whole wide world. When I use. And when I use the Star Rod to increase my strength, even you can't beat me, Mario! Oh my gosh. He's glowing again. And not by Kamek this time. 
He's not even enhanced by Kamek. He enhanced himself. <laughs> How would you like that, Mario? Oh my god. Ow! Three points of damage. That hurts. I'm in danger! <laughs> Is that all you've got? How sad. You'd best take some vitamins. Cause that... Cause that didn't hurt at all. And also, you should probably... You should probably lose some weight. Actually, you probably should gain some weight so that you're hurt... <laughs> gain some... You should probably gain some weight. <laughs> gain some more weight so maybe I can feel... Maybe I can feel your stomps. Oh my gosh. Another three damage, lord. Another three damage, what is this guy, man? How did Bowser get... How's Bowser this smart? Yep, just as I expected. Mario's no match for the new me. Just bats his chest. It's not even worth my time to toy with you, Mario. It's time to end this. Here we go, Mario. Good night. But it's still daytime! Oh, look at that paper fire! Oh my gosh, I just fell over. I just fell over flat on my face. Hopefully I don't get folded over. You know? Oh no, Mario! Get up! Yes! Oh yeah! I did it! What? You did what? You... You... Are you pla... Are, are you pla... What are you doing with your hips, my guy? I finally did it! I beat my old rival Mario! Yes! Yeah, for maybe about 80 episodes, but yeah, that's fine. I'll get you, I'll get you at the end of, at the end of this. Congratulations on your victory, your viciousness. That's why you're the king. As long as I have this star rod, mm, I shouldn't have. Uh, man, I should not have eaten before coming here. Everything I wish will come true. No one can stop me now. I wish I wish that I can no longer be able to hiccup. I, I wish I would no longer be able to have hiccups. I guess I might call Well, well, well. I guess I might as well get rid of Mario. He's no good and he's no good to anyone now, that's for sure. What is he gonna do? Just chuck me at Bro, he, he didn't even. Oh man, he didn't even. Oh no, Mario! Man, he didn't even have the ball. He didn't even have the balls to just grab, just pick me up with his with his turtle hands, and chuck me out the window himself. He had to, he had to use the rod. <laughs> Oh, he has... Hey, okay, at least, you know, being paper and all, uh, no fall damage, right? Uh, there, there's no fall damage for being made out of paper? You know? Type thing? I guess, right? Paper Mario. Paper Mario. And... Prologue. A plea from the stars. Oh, was that the prologue? Or was that the prologue? Oh my gosh, where are we now? Where the hell? Just how long have I been unconscious? Oh my gosh. It's stars. Trans transparent stars. One of them has a must has a severely overgrown mustache. How can he even talk without getting hair in his mouth? I hate that. I hate when I get my hair in my mouth. It's so hard. It's so annoying. Take Green's mustache. 
Oh, thank heavens. He's been gravely injured. But I think he'll recover. Hey, he didn't take that much fall damage since, you know, he's made of paper. Unless he was, you know, punctured or sliced open. Or, like, sliced from a couple trees on the way down or something. Or maybe you guys just, uh, put the wit, uh, blew some wind or something to not do that. But Bowser has the Star Rod. Now he's mightier than Mario. It's hopeless. It's all law. All is lost. Oh, that was the same guy talking. My bad. Everybody just calm down. As long as we keep it together, there's always hope. Now, our fates are in Mario's hands. We must try to revive him. Gather around, everyone. Send Mario your power. Get the tape. Uh, can we redraw Mario? Get get the tape. Uh, fold, fold him up in various ways. So he's just origami now, or something like that. Whew. That's it. That's all we can do right now. Mario, please get up. Please. Hmm, I don't know. Holy crap, is that a Goomba? Is that a Goomba with a bow tie? It really sounded like something fell around here. I heard, pa I heard paper flowing throughout the wind. Oh, who could that be? I don't know. It's a fat Italian man. This red shirt, this hat, and this mustache. I know who... Th I know the... You know, this really looks a lot... This really looks like one of... The one and only Mario. It couldn't be. Could it? The real Mario? The real Italian? The real Italian plumber? Hey! Hey! Wake up! Come on! Up and at him! Can Hyrule's fate really depend on such a, on such a lazy boy? <sighs> Something like that? Oh no, he won't wake up! Quick! Quick! Roll around in the ant- No. Wait, no, that- No, that was Game Grumps. That's Game Grumps' thing, I can't steal that. Roll around in the ants. Roll around in the ants, I don't know. Oh no, what are we gonna do? I don't have any hands, I can't drag him! I don't have hands, I have my mouth! Uh, uh, can I just bite his shirt and just drag him? I don't know. Um, Dad! Goompa! Goombario! Really? Wait, Goompa, Goombario, what? What are these names? What are we doing here? Oh my gosh. Well... Oh my gosh, we're in a bed. But wait, I don't have a blanket on me. How's a piece- how's a piece of paper stand- like, standing like, you know, on its side and whatnot and not falling over? It's not- it's not cardstock. It's not card- it's not even cardboard. Not even close to cardboard. Mario. Ma- can you hear me, Mario? I'm Eldstar, a star spirit. I have something very important to tell you. It concerns the princess and all of the Mushroom Kingdom. Man, we're getting exposition. But sadly, I haven't the strength to talk to you here. Mario, you need to have- you need to have- I need, I need to have you come to the Shooting Star Summit. Like, what? What is that language? Get better at grammar. Go back to, I don't want to say go back to school. I don't want to say go back to school or anything, but, you know, it's just the way it talks, I guess. Please, Mario, please, Mario, we need, we star spirits are, will be waiting for you at the summit. All right, all right. Well, I guess uh, we will. I 
guess, uh, waking up has never been easier, I guess. Oh, Mario! I'm so happy to see you awake! <laughs> oh my gosh. You haven't opened your eyes for days and days! Everyone's been worried sick! This place? This is Goomba Village! It's a tiny village that's just west of Toad Town. The only residents are me and a single family of Goombas. Can you really call it a village, though, if only one family is here? Alright. The Goombas in this village are the nicest folks you'll ever meet. They're the ones who found you unconscious in the forest and carried you here, here to get better. How do they carry me? They don't have, they don't have hands, man. All right. Huh? A star with a mustache. Yeah, a much bigger mustache. You're saying a, a star told you to go to the shooting star summit? Yeah, there's this one. There's this one spirit that looked like a star. And he had a, a gr and he had an overgrown mustache, just a big old mustache. I don't know how he gets hair out of. I don't know how he talks about getting hair in his mouth. Like seriously, no. Now I saw, I saw nothing like that, and I sure didn't see anyone come in or out of this house. I wonder, Mario, maybe you just had a dream. Hmm. What's a dream? Although, maybe not. It sure... It could have been some sort of message from the star... From the star spirit. They live in Star Haven. What the, what the hell is Star Haven? Shooting Star Summit is the nearest place to Star Haven. So that would make sense. Hmm. You know, in any case, I'm glad to see you've recovered. I know the Goombas would have... would be happy to pay them a... If you paid them a visit. Alright, so I guess on the next episode, on this experience, on on uh, Paper Mario 64, we go talk to some Goombas. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed this episode, and we will see you all whenever you're in the tavern. Bye, guys.